Starting tomorrow, as many as 3.6 million Americans face eviction now that Congress has put an end to the eviction moratorium, which started in March 2020 due to the pandemic. This also means up to 100,000 Oregonians. I'm kind of glad that it's expiring. Go out and get a job, do it, and take care of your own because this country's in a sad state of affairs because of the laziness of the American people. However, there are some people who are not in favor of the eviction moratorium ending, saying they were greatly affected by job loss and other factors during the pandemic. But there is some good news. Some local organizations are providing rental assistance for those in need. There are protections for folks that have an, uh, an application in their hand saying, I have applied for rent assistance, outlined in Senate Bill 278. So there are protections if you've applied. So apply for those programs as soon as you possibly can. In addition to renter's assistance, under the state Senate Bill 278, you can get a 60-day eviction pause once a tenant shows their landlord that they have applied. Tim Morris, the executive director of the Springfield Eugene Tenant Association, says you should also be aware of your rights as a resident. There have been so many changes and it can be really confusing, but knowing that information and arming yourself with that knowledge is so critical um, in being able to, to stay in your home and know what resources might be available for you. Reporting in Eugene, Grace Smith, KEZI 9 News.